10 at 10. Good evening, Acadiana. I'm Britt LaFosso. Thanks for joining us. A fire in Lafayette has left two families devastated. News 10's Jasmine Dean spoke with both families about what happened. She joins me now in the studio. Jasmine, what can you tell us? Not only did the homeowner lose everything, but the fire caused some damage to the next door neighbor's home as well. The neighbor says especially devastated as she recently moved to Lafayette from Lake Charles after losing her home to Hurricane Laura. I had to put my head down to pass underneath the smoke. Marlene Pilet, the owner of the home at 207 Randolph Street, says she and her family were asleep when her home caught on fire Sunday morning. She says a neighbor came knocking on the door to get everyone out, which caused her grandson to wake her up. I mean, the second grandson told me, Grandmother, come on, get out of bed. It, we have a fire. And I thought it was a joke. The fire at Pilot's house was so bad it burned some of her neighbor Paula Compton's home. Compton says she was at work when she found out about her home being on fire. I was at work and um, we got a phone call and um, when I got here, a uh, fireman went out here and most of the houses were on fire. Compton says it's devastating how this has happened, especially because she just moved here three months ago from Lake Charles, still trying to recover from Hurricane Laura. There were no injuries reported except for the death of a pet bird belonging to Pilate's daughter. It's, it's bad, but at least we are alive. A spokesperson for the Lafayette Fire Department says it took 20 minutes to get the fire under control, leaving both homes sustaining heavy fire damage. The fire originated under the carport, and the cat and the Investigation is still underway. You can visit our website, KLFY.com, for more information. Jasmine Dean, KLFY News 10.